Hello everyone, it's Dave from DTM Heating and Plumbing Solutions. Just thought I'd do a video today on flushable wipes designed to be flushed down your toilet and toilet roll, normal toilet roll. I'm not reviewing the actual products, just what happens when they go down your toilet. Um, this is just advice to our, our customers, just a little demonstration. Um, I've got Lily May with me Hi. today and Molly. They're the bosses, they're going to make sure we do it all right. Okay, so you see at the moment, we've got two jars of water. Um, they're just pretend toilets. Uh, that's, that's what they are today. So we're just gonna use them as a example. Um, right Molly, if you put a bit of toilet roll in there, and Lily, you put your disposable wipes in there. Open yeah, that much will do. Well, we always do that too much, but let's go. One, that will go. one wipe and Okay, so you put your wipe in your imaginary toilet. And pop your lid on. And you put your toilet roll on your and yeah, not your hands, just your, just the toilet roll will do it. Right, I'll put your lid on, otherwise that will go everywhere. Right, so you tie it. Yeah. Okay, girls, if you give them a shake and it just simulates you flushing the toilet. So when you flush the toilet, all the water swishes around, and that's what happens to the toilet roll and the flushable wipe. So. Give yours a good shake, muscles, that's it. That's it, right. Okay, let's have a look, see what we've got then. So, leave the lid on for a second. Right, so we've got the wipe there. You can see that is almost still intact. Not much has really changed with that. It's still sat there in its original form when you first put it into the jar. You see yours there, Molly. Mm -hmm. That's all broken down and gone all sloshy. You can see it's really starting to sort of break away. Um, yeah, there you go. So that's all sort of thinned out and um, ready to make its way down to the sewer. So you see in there, like Lily's grabbed hers in a whole, um, still in like a whole sheet. The toilet roll, you, you can't do that. It's all, all breaking down quickly by the second. Originally this was thick, now it's gone really thin. It's a bit thinner now, isn't it? Yeah. But, so what we're doing, this demonstration, just shows you that the troubles that these things can cause. And so we don't do much with drainage or toilets uh, as a company, um, but just advice to our customers, this is the main cause of a lot of um, drain blockages, toilet blockages, that sort of thing. If you've got any, uh, any roots or um, any problems with your drains or like old um, drainage pipe work, these things can cause all sorts of carnage. So our recommendation um, from us three is use your toilet roll down the toilets if you want to save your money for things like summer holidays, Christmas presents, that sort of stuff. Drainage and unblocking your toilet certainly isn't the most exciting thing to spend, spend your money on. So from the three of us here at DTM Heating and Plumbing Solutions, that's it and we're all done. Bye. Thank you. Bye-bye.